Good morning, guys. Today I thought I would work on something a little different. I'm doing bookmarks. This one we did out of cardstock, and I'm gonna have a template how to do it real simple out of cardstock. And then I also did a couple here out of fabric, and it makes them a little more finished. Say you wanted to give someone a really fun gift, a book, and then you could put a personalized fabric bookmark in there. But let's get started. So the, I'm gonna start with the cardstock one, and this is really fast and simple. So this is actually gonna be your template, and you can either just put it on your copy machine and then run your cardstock through, and it'll print it out, or you can just cut out your template and trace around your cardstock. So you're gonna cut it out. You can see there's a square here and then two triangles on the edge. And I'm just taking the corner of the square and I'm just scoring straight down and make sure it's lining up with that. And then also on this side and just score it right there. Then all you're gonna do is fold it over and uh, use an adhesive to keep it shut. This one I actually sewed around and added an extra little piece on top before I sewed the, all the edges down. But on here, I think I'm just gonna use a glue stick. And I think if you have a heavy duty glue stick or any type of adhesive or double stick tape, or you can sew it. And that is such an easy little pocket. And then you could add other papers to it, or maybe I'll just add this cute little stamp. This is a fun project that if you use double-sided paper, then you have both sides already decorated. Cute little bookmark page saver. Now let's get to the fabric one. So for the fabric um, bookmark page savers, you're gonna need three pieces of fabric and they're five by five inch squares. And that, so you don't really need a pattern, just three five by five inch squares, whatever fabrics you wanna use. This one I did a transfer on, and this one I just stamped. So when you have your three pieces of fabric, first thing you're gonna do is I take one of them and I fold them at an angle, at a diagonal here, and iron it down so now you have a triangle. What I'm gonna do next is whatever I want for the back that it's gonna show is gonna be facing up. So this will be the back of my bookmark. I'm gonna take these two raw edges and put them on the two sides. And this is the folded finished edge. Then I'm gonna take the piece that is facing the front. When I'm done, I need to be able to turn it inside out. And what I found the easiest thing to do was to take this, I'm just going to take this, kind of fold it and make a little slit. So, this is the right side and it's facing towards this right side. And actually, this is the right side also. Well, let's just sew it together and you'll see when we turn it inside out. So, I have this in my machine and I'm just gonna sew around all four um, edges. So now we're just gonna trim around it and at the corners I just kind of go straight across so you don't have that bunchiness when you turn it inside out. Now I'm just gonna turn it inside out with the slit. Now this actually is gonna go over the slit, so I'm just gonna lay this over the top. And I'm gonna poke these little corners out real quick, just so it's nice and flat, and then iron it flat. So here we are, this is iron flat, and this is the back. And underneath here, you're going to see that slit. So at this point, you can either just whip stitch that shut, or what I did is use some heat and bond and another piece of fabric, and I just ironed it right over the slit. And you can use the same fabric or something different, but you just want that closed, otherwise your papers will get stuck in that slit. So I will end up um, 
ironing a piece of fabric in there and then all I'm gonna do is just use another really simple stamp again the same butterfly and I'm just gonna stamp it right here and make it very simple but you can embellish it in any way that you would like and there you go well I hope this seemed really really simple so you guys can do some up yourself whether you do them out of fabrics or out of card stocks but whatever you do have fun